for as long as I can remember, I knew I wanted to be a doctor. I always told my mom, I want to be a doctor. And this carried out throughout high school. My sophomore year, I was introduced to an engineering course as an elective, and I decided to take it. We went on a field trip to a refinery in California, and we were actually introduced to a whole panel of engineers. I was chatting with one of them, and she asked me what I wanted to do with my future, and I told her I wanted to be a doctor, but I really find engineering really interesting, but wasn't sure how that could relate, and she then told me she was a biomedical engineer. And so with this knowledge and with this new goal, I actually took an atypical route of going to college. I started at community college, did that for about two and a half years, and then I transferred over to ASU with, for their amazing biomedical engineering program. Internships are really important, so I did a few internships throughout my undergrad, and actually one of those internships was here at Humo Biologics. They hired me on as a quality intern, and once I graduated, they hired me on full-time, and I've just absolutely loved my role here, and I love the world of quality, and I know I want to keep pushing in this direction. Advice that I would give in pursuing any career is explore the possibilities of every career facet that you can look into. For as long as I knew, I knew I wanted to be a doctor. I was very firm in that, and then one day out of the blue, I had one conversation, one 15-minute conversation with one person, and that changed the entire scope of my career goals in life. Because of that, I learned as much as I could about all facets of engineering, and now I wound up getting my undergrad in biomedical engineering, still connected with that doctor aspect that I loved, 